So, good morning. If you ever wonder why a mom takes so long, I just got pooped on. Uh, it's everywhere. Yeah, I'll get you a snack. So we had to change her, and then I have to change. And then I had to clean. I got snacks. No, grab the other ones. No, I like this one. Okay. Then I had to clean the car seat before I put her in, so that she wouldn't get poop on her car seat. So. That's what's happening. We're gonna go for a walk to get out of the house, take the kids for a bike ride. But yeah, that is why moms take so long <laughs> to get ready. Officially the second week of postpartum um, after having the baby. Here she is, all fed and happy. Hi, sweet girl. She has hiccups right now, but I just changed her diaper and She's just hanging out. I'm gonna put her down in the bath in the bouncer so she can hang out. Okay, and then I wanted to update you guys on this LV curve because I did do a haul on it. Um, but I have been loving it while I'm breastfeeding. I stick it on the other side and it's just like a little suction. It's almost like the Hakka. I have no experience with the Hakka. So um, this is my ex first experience with like a silicone pump. Um, I got three ounces you can kind of see um it holds only four but um so while your baby is on one side you can put this on the other and then it'll um collect your milk for you i've also been loving these collection cups by the same brand and you put them in your bra so that when you leak they don't leak on top of your clothes and you can wear them up to three hours um and they've been really helpful they're really cool too because 
um, they kind of help keep your breast protected. Like if you're breastfeeding, um, your nipples get kind of cracked and sore. So this is what it looks like in your bra. It really just looks like you're wearing a padded bra. And this is the other side. So you really can't tell. Um, and it, I'm just at home, so it really doesn't matter. But they're really comfortable to wear and I've been loving it. And excuse my armpits because I'm getting them waxed and I needed to grow them out. But yeah, so far so good with the LV Curve. I've been loving it. I collect like two to four ounces each time I put it on and I put it on every time I breastfeed just because um, I'm not gonna let my milk go to waste. And then here's my update on milk. I've got a little stash going on. So I've got, I went through a pack of the Lancinol um, bags. So I went through 25 already. So I have a pretty good stash. Oops. Um, and I'm really stoked. So I've been using the curve and it's been really helping me keep up the stash. Um, I'm not probably, I don't know when I'm gonna go back to work. Um, and it's not like I am in a rush because Somebody needs to take care of baby, and I don't think I want to pay someone to take care of her. So, um, I'm just building the stash for when she gets older and is going to need more ounces um, because they, they'll they need like six to eight ounces later on when they're older. Uh, so, yeah, that's what I'm doing. My kitchen is a mess right now, but the lighting is so good right here. But yeah, that is my update on the LV Curve. Um, I've been loving the LV Pump and it's been truly a blessing to have that thing. But yeah. Okay, so this is real life. Good morning. So we are one day shy from three weeks and here is baby. Hi, sweet girl. <laughs> she has powder all over her because all of her little wrinkles have, um, they don't really see air too much. So I put powder in there for it to freshen up. We puked in that last night. So we have to wash it. What's going on? Here's my morning look. Um, I'm trying out this bra 
to see um, how I like it. So far, it's been pretty good. It's a nursing bra. Got like a little blanket over it. Tell you the laundry never really ends when you have kids. I have a load here that I need to do. And there's just a bunch of things all on the ground. Um, but yeah, we made it to week two and the kids are gonna go on a little bike ride with their daddy. And I'm gonna enjoy some quiet time. Yeah.